shout out to Squarespace for sponsoring this week's video. Good morning. I just woke up. And the first thing I'm gonna do is put on my Apple Watch and check the weather. Right now it's 22 degrees and the highest is going to be 27. Dang, it's really warm. By the way, I'm still used to Celsius, so I have my settings to metric system. Oh my gosh, what day is it today? 25th. It's May next week, and basically it's summer, so I guess it makes sense. But wow. In my head, it's still like March. So it's crazy that's going to be May soon. Wow. Anyways. Because it's nice outside, I think I'm gonna go out for a walk because whenever I wake up, I like waking up and eating breakfast right away because if I'm not eating breakfast, why why do I want to get up, right? So I like to get up and get breakfast because breakfast is exciting. That's something that gets me out of bed. But I'm not hungry right now because I was uploading my video late at night last night and I got frustrated and I needed something to eat so I ate a sandwich at like 11. So I'm not that hungry. That sandwich I feel like is still inside of my stomach digesting. So I'm gonna move a little bit so that I can digest it and I can eat food again. So I'm gonna get changed. Oh, by the way, it's 11.47 for those of you thinking that I woke up early and I'm having a productive Saturday. Here's my morning skin routine. Purito Centella Green Level Calming Toner on a cotton pad. Make sure everything Pat it in <clears throat> and then I use my Innisfree Brightening Pore Serum. I love this because this smells so fresh. I love the scent and it puts me in a good mood whenever I use it in the morning. And it's a very watery consistency so I don't feel nasty for feeling sticky in the morning too. And since we're going outside, Let's just skip right to the sunscreen. This one's really moisturizing, so I don't have to put like a separate moisturizer under it. Oh, my Apple Watch is like, why are you not moving today? And that's because I woke up late. My watch is like, are you okay? Are you broken? Okay, I'm gonna put on my lip balm. I've been liking my the Nage sleeping mask. Where's my phone? I got this thing from Amazon. It's basically a phone charger, Apple Watch charger, and an AirPod charger at the same time. It's been very nice, so I don't have to have like three separate cords next to me. I'll link it in the description box if I can find it, but yeah, I've been really liking that. And I need to find my phone and leave because, oh. It's right here. Also gonna grab my water. This is the almond that I'm going to make almond milk with. Why does it look so frosty and weird? Anyways, I'll do that after I get back from my walk. I'm really excited. Ugh. I need to figure out what I'm gonna do on my walk today because I don't like just walking because just walking is kind of boring to me so i either have to like listen to a podcast listen to a youtube video listen to music but i don't want to i don't know what i want to listen to today i'll figure it out okay bye i have this amazon package to unbox it is very echoey, echoey in here. Oh, by the way, I went out for a walk for like 20 minutes and then I did some workouts inside. 
And then I showered and kind of got ready. So yeah, and I put on a nice shirt. I haven't worn this shirt since like first day of senior year. So. The first thing I got is cacao nibs. I love putting these into my smoothies because I like having that crunchiness in my smoothies. And yeah. I ran out of the other one, or I think it expired, so I threw it away. So I got myself a new packet. I'm very excited for that. And then I got this protein powder. This is protein and greens. So you're getting a serving of greens and protein in this powder. So I'm going to put these into my smoothies. Um, yeah, I think I might make... A chocolate smoothie for breakfast today. It is already 1.30 though, so I guess it's lunch, but I haven't eaten so. And then lastly, whoa, this is thick. But I got a new book. It's called The 4-Hour Work Week. Escape 9 to 5, Live Anywhere, and Join the New Rich. Anyways, I don't know if there's like a Korean version of this, but I got this book because I saw... I was listening to a podcast and someone was talking about this book and I was like, that sounds pretty interesting. So I wanted to try it out. It's very thick, but um, I don't think it's going to be a hard read because there are a lot of like spaces. So good, oh my gosh. When it all goes crashing down, I've been trying to keep my cool It is time to make my almond milk. I just watched a YouTube video on it and they said that if you take the shells off the almond, it will become more creamy. The video made it look really easy, but actually it takes kind of a lot of work. It's kind of cute. Oh wait, that was quick. Okay, I think I can do it. I just tasted it and it kind of just tastes like water so I don't know if I put in too much water or I, I don't know but we're gonna put it through the milk bag and see how it turns out That's pretty good. It's a very different taste from what you get from the store. But you can definitely taste the almond. And I can taste the date that I added in. That is pretty cool. But I'm gonna start doing this because I have a huge bag of almonds at home. And that's just been sitting there in our pantry because no one was eating it. And now I can make almond milk out of it. Yum. When was the last time I vlogged? I think it was when I tried my almond milk. Oh my gosh, anyways. Hours have passed since then. I've just been working. Um, if you watched my vlog from yesterday, I talked about how like I was having a very chill Friday because I was waiting for 
files so that I could do my work and I got my file at like 3 p.m. today so I've just been working through the whole day um, I'm now pretty much done so I was going to treat myself with this drink I was also I don't know if you can see on the camera but like my makeup is all smudged because I was having a stomach ache for like two hours and I cried for two hours straight in my bed and I'm very dehydrated from crying so I'm gonna <laughs> hydrate myself with this drink I love this brand it's called Bai B-A-I and they have these flavored water is this water? it's flavored antioxidant beverage with vitamin C this is blueberry flavored I've never had this flavor before so I'm really excited but for me these taste like those iced tea drinks from Starbucks like the refresher drinks they're actually even better than the ones from Starbucks because I find the Starbucks one very bland but these ones are really good, especially if you mix it with sparkling water and ice. It's so good. Why does this taste like cough syrup? <laughs> and these are pretty healthy. I buy them every once in a while just to treat myself because the whole point of me using a reusable water bottle is to save plastic. And this is still, you know, plastic, so I don't want to be buying this every day I'm only gonna drink like half of it so I can save this and drink it tomorrow I don't I don't think I've ever had a blueberry flavored drink before this is very interesting mmm I don't like this one. Sorry. I don't know. It's just a very interesting taste. It kind of tastes like cough syrup. But it also is very refreshing. I feel like if I mixed this with sparkling water and ice, it would have been a lot better. Oreo, I so love this. And the cool thing is, I've only charged this once. I literally charged it when I first got it, and it's still going strong. It's been like five months, and I use it almost every day. I just had. The greatest idea, I'm going to paint my nails while I watch Netflix. That sounds so nice. For nighttime skincare routine, I honestly do the same thing. No, I don't. I use the same toner. But then I use a serum that's more... Is this a serum? Wait. I use a ampule. I use like a more moisturizing product for nighttime. And then for moisturizer, I use the matching moisturizer, which is pro pro propolis. How do I say this? Pro propolis. Pro propolis. 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 What the heck? I don't know. Propolis. <laughs> this set from Cosrx. I am getting sleepy and it's not even 11. I also stopped drinking coffee, which is a big deal for me. It was really hard, but I stopped drinking and I've been doing fine. I just miss the taste of coffee, to be honest.
Actually, I'm not gonna wear my Apple Watch just because I want today to be that day of the week where I disconnect from social media and take time for myself. I went to bed last night with a migraine and I honestly thought I would wake up feeling better but I still woke up with a migraine I took Tylenol because I don't have uh, I don't have medicine for migraines so I just took Tylenol hoping that it would get better I'm still not feeling good like I still have migraine but I've been on my phone which is probably not helping I've just been watching YouTube, catching up. I've been really into Girl Stay Hedy's vlog. For some reason, I haven't watched them before, and I got into it last night, and I've been binge watching. And um, I think now I'm gonna go eat something, even though I ate breakfast and came straight to bed. Oh, I love my bed. Right now, I'm trying to make up like a logo for my name. This is what I have so far. I like how it's basically like the Y, the curve and the Y is also acting as a J. But I don't like, I don't love it, but I like the idea. Hey guys, this is not a flattering angle, but today I was feeling just so anxious for some reason. As soon as I woke up, I was not i just couldn't relax my body and i felt so anxious my heart was beating fast like the whole day and i try to listen to music to calm myself down i try to watch some youtube to just relax and chill but i couldn't so like i showed you guys i try to work a little bit try to do something productive but then i was like this is not it this is not working so i ended up taking a nap i got up ate some food I am now going to sit in bed and watch a movie. I even got my popcorn ready here. So yeah, this is a reminder that you should listen to your body and give it some rest if it needs some. If you're feeling anxious, don't be afraid to nap. Don't be afraid to eat something that you like to eat. I just ate cereal because I love cereal. Um, yeah, I'm gonna watch Call Me By Your Name because I haven't watched it, I've never watched it and everyone's been obsessing over Timothy Chalamet for some reason so I need to see what the hype is I'm gonna watch it, I rented it on Amazon Prime I'm very excited I will be ending my vlog here Thank you guys so much for watching, oh this smells so good Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video, bye! Hold up. Before I say bye for real, I wanted to talk about Squarespace. Squarespace provides people this powerful and beautiful platform to create their own space online. So you can create your own blog, your own website, whatever you want. I personally created a website for myself where I can write blog posts and have all my social media links in the front page. You can set up email campaigns through Squarespace. You can set up a scheduling system for your online business. You can also utilize their analytics page to track your engagement or to strategize to come up with a marketing plan. You can go to squarespace.com for a free trial and use my link to get 10% off your first purchase on Squarespace. All right, thank you so much for watching my video. Check out my blog posts and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye guys.